Hi, this is going to give you an idea how to use the Window Movie Maker. Now, I've already went through the uh, section here of importing media and and grabbed this particular one here and imported it. Now, it's it's not in your video yet, so what we'll do is just click and hold that and drag it down here to the timeline. Okay. Now we're going to put a little title at the beginning. It'll just say hello. Keep it simple. Huh? Add that title. This is a real short uh, piece of film here, so it'll work good for not taking up a lot of time here. Titles and credits. We'll put a credit at the end. Credit at the end. Let's say something original like the end. Add that. Okay. Add that. Now there's another thing you can do is uh, effects. And that changes all sorts of things about how the film might look. Uh, you can go black and white, old timey film, it's all messed up. Uh, transitions, when you go from one, uh, let's click, double click that, see what happens. Right there. Slap that there, that's a transition. And slap this one here, that's a transition. And then when you back it up to the beginning and hit the play button, it says hello. It goes into a movie. Well, the transitions didn't come out, but anyway, this is it. And when I started, I didn't know what I was doing or what to expect or nothing. So here you go. Uh, the Windows Movie Makers. I, I messed with a few others. This is by far the easiest, and it doesn't cost anything if you got Windows. So use this one, and I promise if you keep playing around with it, you'll get good in no time. But you cannot do it in one setting. Just keep practicing and keep your stuff short because it'll save space on your computer until you get something you really want to, you know, make really well. So there you go. Hope you enjoyed this video.